Millions of people across the country have gotten the COVID-19 vaccine since the rollout began. And as we mentioned, more people will have the chance to get a dose come Monday. And ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell is breaking down any possible vaccine side effects and the best way to prepare yourself when you roll up your sleeve. Day after day, Floridians continue to get in line for their dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. The very next day, my arm was sore. And then after that, everything's been fine. Jackie Eisiger is a local assistant principal and got her second shot today. She told me she's had teachers who've had a second dose with minimal side effects and others with more. For her, she explains why the benefits outweigh any risks. Honestly, I think it's working in a school and being exposed to 580 kids daily and being around the school and just making sure that I keep myself and my family safe. Here's a few common side effects fatigue, headache, muscle pain, chills, fever, or nausea. In the arm you got the shot, you could have some pain, redness, or swelling. Know if you're getting a two-dose COVID vaccine, side effects could be a little more significant after the second shot. To prepare yourself for any possible side effects, I took your questions straight to USF Health's Dr. Michael Tang. So your immune response to the vaccine is behaving like it's seeing a viral infection when, it, when it's not really seeing a viral infection. But this is a good thing because the next time you get exposed to that same antigen or if you get exposed to, you know, sars cov 2 itself, your immune system will come up really quickly and, and hopefully get rid of the virus before you know it. Side effects should go away in a few days. And if you don't have any side effects, Tang says that's perfectly normal, too. It'll take two weeks after your last dose in this series to be considered fully vaccinated. Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.